Hello friends and welcome to the Coin Engineer YouTube channel. We are together again with another testnet video. Today we will learn how to use SyncSwap in the ZK Sync ecosystem. If you don't know about this ecosystem, you can watch our ZK Sync tutorials from the card in the top right corner. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, turn on the notifications, and join our Telegram community to keep up with upcoming events. Now let's get started. <laughs> ZK Sync provides various decentralized applications and we will use one of the decentralized exchanges today. But we will need a MetaMask wallet and faucet tokens for the girly and ZK Sync alpha networks. If you don't have a MetaMask wallet, you can watch our MetaMask tutorials from the card in the top right corner. And if you don't know how to activate the girly testnet on MetaMask, go to your wallet settings, click on advanced, open the test networks, then go to your networks and select girly. Now that you added the girly network, you must have the faucet tokens to pay the gas fees. Register to this page with your email account, copy your wallet address, paste it into this box, and click the send me Ethereum button. You will find all the links I'm using below this video. After receiving the faucet tokens, you must transfer some of them to your ZK Sync Alpha network. And to do that, you must use the ZK bridge. But before that, you must add the ZK Sync Alpha network. Here is the swap platform we will be using today. Log into this website with your MetaMask wallet and confirm each request on your screen to activate the alpha network. Then use this page to send some Ethereum coins from your girly network to the alpha network through the bridge option. For example, I will send 0.1 Ethereum to use in this testnet. You can also use the wallet option to see the current balance, send tokens to other wallets or use the QR code to receive from other wallets. Finally, we can start testing the SyncSwap era. Connect your wallet, select the alpha network, and start swapping each coin with Ethereum first, then with each other. After doing that, we will use the pool option to provide liquidity. You may not be able to succeed for each pool, but try as much as possible. Here, let me show you how. And last but not least, don't forget to join the Discord channel and provide feedback to earn Discord roles that might be useful in the future. Soon, we will have more videos like this one. And you can always show your support by joining our community, commenting, and liking our videos. Thank you for watching and take care. Until next time. <laughs>